Building on the work done by Pasteur, Robert Koch set about finding a specific microbe that caused a disease. In 1875, he found the microbe that was causing anthrax, a disease that affected many animals but could also affect people. His success led the German government to fund Koch to set up the Berlin Institute of Infectious Diseases. Koch and his team at the Institute discovered the microbes causing TB in 1882 and cholera in 1883. Scientists at the Berlin Institute would go on to make many more important discoveries. Koch's work had more of an immediate impact than Pasteur's work initially had, because it was directly in the field of medicine Koch was a doctor himself, and was therefore trusted by other doctors. Finding a specific microbe that caused a disease, Koch proved that germ theory was not just a theory, but true. Largely due to Koch's work, by 1885 almost all scientists and doctors finally accepted microbes as the cause of some diseases. Koch discovered and developed successful methods that other scientists would be able to use to make other discoveries in the future. He developed a way of growing bacteria as solids. Pasteur used liquids which were difficult to work with. He found that chemical dyes could stain certain microbes, therefore it was easier to identify the microbe causing a disease through the microscope. He also found a more effective way of killing microbes than carbolic acid. Steam, surgeons would use this to improve surgery. Koch's work inspired other scientists to work in bacteriology. Most noticeably, Pasteur dedicated himself to studying disease full-time from 1877, which led to him developing vaccines to prevent certain diseases. Pasteur's work also led him to discover that some diseases are caused by viruses. The work of Koch, Pasteur and their teams was hugely important in providing further evidence that some diseases were caused by microbes. This had an impact on improving hygiene and cleanliness in hospitals and society in general which reduced disease and infection, convincing governments and voters to invest in public health provisions, ensuring that scientific research for improvements in health and medicine would continue and increase. However, their work did not have an impact on medical treatment at the time. Being able to identify the specific microbe causing a specific disease did not help cure people of that disease, but it would do in the future as other scientists continued to use their findings and methods in bacteriology to discover treatments such as magic bullets and antibiotics. 